Zap has a quick start scan feature that you can use to do scanning easily on a site. To start, we're going to go ahead and start Zap running. We're going to make sure that Zap is listening on the same port that Firefox has configured to send all the traffic. So on Firefox, I have that configured to proxy port 8081. In Zap, I can check the port by using tools options or clicking on the gear icon, clicking on local proxy, and making sure that this matches the proxy port that I have set up in Firefox. In this case, it's also 8081. I'm going to browse to the site through Zap. And you'll see the site appear over here on the left hand side. So I now know we have a good connection to the site. So going back over to the target site, I'm going to start from the home page. Copy that URL, go back to Zap, and paste it over here in the URL to attack window. Then I'm going to click attack. Notice that I went ahead and started from the home page. That page has a lot of links on it that go off into the other pages. The first thing the scanner is going to do is it's going to spider the site. So you'll see the spider tab activated here. Then as it spiders the site, it's going to list the pages that it found down inside the window here. Once the spidering is complete, the active scan will start and the tool will switch over to the active scan. As problems are found inside of the site, they'll accumulate over under the alerts tab. You can also see a small area at the bottom that will display the alerts so far. If you click on the alerts tab, you'll see the alerts displayed. The flags indicate the problems that were found, yellow for medium severity, orange for high, and red for critical.